There was a time when you'd have to bring a camera to take a picture and also have a photo album to keep the pics. Well, in Milo, a guy on Cherokee Street is keeping the old ways alive. He has quite a collection to point and click. In the back of the antique shop is where you will usually find Andy Holman, either tinkering on cameras or talking about them. You know, the kind of cameras our press photographers used back in the day. He's not an expert. I just consider myself a hobbyist. A hobby that started from his mother's urging to do something in the arts. I wasn't a very good painter, though I tried. Uh, photography, I think, was the one thing that really stuck for me. I think I just, it clicked. The clicking. Started shooting with everything I could get my hands on. Turning into collecting. I bought a lot of cameras. From the old. There's stuff in here probably from the, I want to say late 1800s. To the newer. They've all got their pluses and their minuses and their quirks and their, uh, their joys of use. Andy's collection of cameras is vast. There's probably close to 700 cameras in the shop. The assortment is sort of a byproduct of his upbringing. My grandma was an antiquer. My mom was an antiquer. These days, everyone's a photographer now. Everyone's taking pictures. He's seen a lot more people moving away from their cell phones. A lot of people coming in and, and buying them. And picking up something more sophisticated. Some people are pretty hip and trendy and they just want a little point and shoot to take to the club. And then there's other people who shoot more seriously. Even though snapping pics using film can be a bit risky. A lot of people who have come in and say they have a hard time trusting film because they don't see the back of their camera, like some of the younger generation have never, never shot film. So they're a little nervous about it. But Andy Holman is all for this style of photography, and he welcomes the resurgence. You don't want to see any art form disappear. Even if it means some up-and-coming photographers getting their hands on pieces of his prize collection. These are St. Louis cameras. I know that sounds weird. And I kind of want them to go back into St. Louis hands. Right now, there is a resurgence of people using film cameras. According to Marketplace.org, Generation Z is behind the renewed interest, and it's all fueled by the nostalgia.